You may have seen the colorful sign hanging above your head, but there's a good chance you never went inside. But now in downtown Cincinnati bar, which opened in the early 1800s, the Bay Horse Cafe is back in business. As local 12's Jeff Hurst shows us, the bar never would have come back unless downtown had come back first. Of all the symbols of downtown Cincinnati's rebirth, new office towers, new housing, this may in its own way be the most dramatic. The history of this bar is amazing. It's, it's basically 200 years. The Bay Horse Cafe today came back from the dead. A one-time vacant and deteriorating eyesore, now welcoming customers. I think I'm gonna go ahead and turn on the sign. The neon horse in front, glowing once more. Hello, gentlemen. How are you enjoying your beers? Delicious. Good. Beer was pretty much the entire menu when the Bay Horse opened in 1817 along the Ohio River. The bar moved several times, finally to its current 6th Street and Main location in 1962, once serving more Hudipole than any tavern in the city. In its heyday, the Bay Horse Cafe was a working man's bar. That's the women, too, of course. But when it closed in 2004, to be charitable, it had fallen on hard times. To be realistic, it was a dump. Fred Berger and Lori Meeker spent the past two and a half years fixing the place up. Well, we opened up the front door and the original sign was in here. And I thought, oh, that's wonderful. And I said, I remember the tile floors. So we started peeling up the, the floors, the pergo peeling sticks, and there it was. It was just beautiful. Restored to its old time glory, the Bay Horse should become a neighborhood bar once again. But the neighborhood has changed. More empty nesters, more office workers, more people who ride here on the streetcar. It's full of people. People come by, they look at the sign. I think it's a good thing with the streetcar. Letha Goodson did not come by streetcar, but she was not about to miss the reopening. Goodson was the last bartender when the Bay Horse closed in 2004. And now? It's beautiful. It has really changed. <laughs> it was a mess before. <laughs> the Bay Horse will not open again for a 5 a.m. shot in a beer like the old times. Now it's a more civilized 11 a.m. But those old times will not be forgotten. The history on the wall is not just George Washington and Betsy Ross because it's old. No, this is our history. And you can drink it all in once more. Jeff Hirsch, Local 12 News. And legend has it that the name comes from the old days when a reddish chestnut colored horse or a bay horse wandered into the bar. The 1817 origin makes the bay horse the oldest bar in town, sort of. It's not the oldest continually operated. That honor belongs to Arnold's in the same downtown location since 1861. Cool. Nice to see you. Yeah. Yep.